Hello and welcome to another summary of Weapons of the Week. This chapter is called Normal Exploration, Normal Exploitation, Normal Resistance. So the chapter begins with two quotes and um, I think they're quite um, useful for, un for grasping the uh, general outline of this chapter and they basically say the great insurrections were altogether um, were altogether too disorganized to make any to achieve any lasting result the patient silent struggles stubbornly carried on by rural communities over the years would accomplish more than these these flashes in the pan. This is by Mark Block. So this sort of outlines what this chapter is going to be about in that this chapter is saying that the peasantry and the rural population have small little ways of getting across that they want change and bringing about change. Um, and then the they then discuss um, what brought about the idea for this study which is um, they had a growing uh, dissatisfaction with the subject of peasant rebellion and revolution so they f the author felt like his work along with others work never really explained fully how peasant rev uh, rebellion and revolution came about so the, again this leads nicely into their idea of the fact that um, the the build up to revolution is when something is critically wrong but this passive um, non-confrontational way of um, resisting is in uh, what he pre what the author pre presents as actually quite a bit more powerful um, I'm going to do this first, this second chapter in parts because this book is a bit more um, theoretically strong than, or theoretically difficult, for, for theor, theoretically intense than the um, the dope fiend that I done before this book. So there will be a, a second part to this. So um, thank you for watching this part.